Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to get this Halloween deer look. Obviously I'm lacking ears and things, but you know. If you wanted to be clever, you could put headlights on and be a deer in the headlights. No? Okay. We're going to start off with bronzing. I'm just taking my normal bronzer and just contouring it up, putting it on the forehead everywhere. We want a really nice bronze deer look, you know what I mean? Next I'm taking just a highly pigmented blush and I'm kind of just contouring more with this and also just adding some color to the face. Next thing I'm going to do is take a thick white pencil. I'm using the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. You can pretty much use any, any one that you have that is pigmented enough to kind of do this and I'm just putting it all over my nose and then my forehead in like the t-zone area just blending that out with my finger and then I'm going to take a powder and just set all that and kind of blend it into the bronzer that we just did then I'm going to prime my eyes I'm just using a Jordana cheap eye primer just put this all over the lid up to the brow bone anywhere that we're going to apply color and the eyeshadow I'm using for this whole look is the Naked 2 palette, so any of the eyeshadows you see here can be found in that palette. Um, I'm using the dark matte black shade and just kind of making like a winged liner with it really quick. It doesn't have to be perfect. We're putting other eyeshadow over it. It's just to get like the base color on there. Then I'm going to be taking a brown shade and just applying that with a flat shader brush over top of that. Both eyes and just kind of blending it up to the crease. Then I'm going to be taking the darkest brown shade in that palette and just putting that in my crease with the same flat shader brush that I used before. And I wanted kind of like a, what's that word? Exact line? No, I don't know what that word is. I wanted a line. So I'm not going to like fully blend it out. I wanted it to be a dramatic kind of cat eye look. Then I'm going to be putting liner is just regular black liquid liner about half an inch down from my eye towards the bridge of my nose out and making a winged liner with that and then I'm using that same NYX jumbo eye pencil in milk and putting that in my waterline and also below my waterline to make my eyes look way bigger as you'll see then again I'm going to be taking that same white and putting it under my brow bone and then blending it out with my finger and following up with that same white eyeshadow that we used to blend the T-zone. Now I'm doing the bottom liquid liner. I'm just putting this in a line underneath that white right where the white stops and then I'm not fully dragging it to the outer corner. I'm just stopping right there. Now to make the nose of the deer, I'm taking a black eyeliner and dragging it from where my eyebrow starts and then kind of tracing that shadow that you can already see of the bridge of the nose around in a circle and then back up. Now the best way I can describe this part is to just kind of Make two little circles on each side of your nose and then connect that. Now I'm going to intensify the eyebrows. I'm just using a dark brown eye pencil and just kind of deepening it up and already, you know, just going over your eyebrows, making them more defined. This is optional, but I think that it kind of really pulls the look together. Then I'm going in with another bronzer. This is just a dark brown bronzer with that small brush that we used before. And I'm just putting this right in my cheekbones and it's going to even define it farther. And then I'm also dragging it down a little bit just to, you know, get the face of a deer, guys. Here's my mascara face. Nobody needs to see that. Now we're going to use the same jumbo eye pencil in milk and make sure it's sharpened because we are going to be drawing circles. As you can see, look how fun this looks. We're just going to draw as many as you feel like drawing. I think I drew five or six, somewhere around there.
Then to finish out the look, I'm just going to use a nude lip gloss, or lip gloss, lipstick, whatever you want. You could use a gloss. This is Max Creme de Nude. Just putting that baby on. This is the finished look. Thumbs up this video if you liked it. Comment down below with what you are going to be for Halloween. Hope you guys have an awesome Halloween. Love ya. That's it. Okay, bye.